Hello, Brian from ERAD Films. This is what I had to do to get Blender 3.6 and Kitbash 3D's cargo working together. Note, I have only done this on Windows. In this demonstration, I don't go over the standard installation procedures or extracting files. First thing you need to do is download and install Blender 3.6. Also download the zip version of Blender 3.5.1. Next you will extract the zip for Blender 3.5.1. I just put it in the same location where Blender 3.6 resides. Next download Kitbash 3D's Cargo. There is a download button in the top right corner on kitbash3d.com. Next extract the cargo zip file, then run the executable. When you get to the part where Cargo is trying to locate installed software, it will fail. Even using the manual locator, it will fail with 361 LTS. Therefore, you want to select the manual config for software and you want to point it to the 351 executable. Next, you'll load Blender 3.5.1 and enable the plugin to complete the setup for Cargo. Note, this can take a few minutes, and once completed, the final step will be importing a castle model into Blender. Once the castle model shows up, close Blender 351 and load Blender 36. Then you'll go under the Add-ins section and enable Kitbash 3D's plugin. Make sure to activate. And finally, open Cargo and load up a free asset to test. If you have any questions, please ask them in the comments. If you don't mind liking and subscribing, that would be great as well. Thank you.